Hey guys, so I'm back with the last video for the day. I just finished um, banding my hair, which I mentioned I was about to do in the last video. So, if you're wondering why does she keep wearing the same clothes, that's why I just got through doing my hair and it's the same day. So, um, I want to show you uh, um, a quick little, well, I don't know how quick it's going to be, but a collective haul from some stores I want to. So, I'm going to start with this first haul I did. Well, I don't know this first one, but I'm going to start with um, CVS. They have a little coupon or extra reward. But it's something I forgot. I think it's a coupon or something like that. Um, when you, if you, you take your little care card or whatever, CVS care card, whatever, take it in on a little uh, receipt machine, scan it, and you will get a coupon $5 back off of um, any $15 you spend on cosmetics. So, and it's any cosmetics, not a certain brand. And I think that's going until the 11th, according to the website when I looked at it on... I went to the store on the 9th, so that was Thursday. So, ooh, I meant, I meant to post this on Thursday, but I was too tired to do it. So, if you all happen to see this today, you can still get in there because it ends today. So, sorry for the late notice, but some of you all might have already been aware of that because I know there are several people who post, post deal alerts. So, and then also... Um, Maybelline was having two for ten on their Valium Express mascara, um, the quad shadows, and then the Sensational Lips. I think is what it was called. But what I purchased was um, these two. I don't have these, and these are normally eight twenty nine. Um, so it's. I got it in 211, very black, and it's the um, Valium Express Mascara, the classic Valium Express. And then I got it in 270, black is black, and this is the um, the Mega Plush. And so it says it has a flexor brush in there, so that'll be interesting to see. And then it says the Revolutionary Gel Mousse Formula, so Mega Valium, no brittle feel. I like the way that brush looks though. So I'll be interested to see how those work out. So I got those and to get it to $15, this and oh, also Wet n Wild is having two for, um, I mean buy one get one 50% off. So to get it as close to $15 as I could, I bought this. Which I've been wanting to try this, but I didn't. This is four dollars. I don't want to just pay four dollars for this. And it's the Yin Yang, the number one fourteen. It's the perfect pair eye one. So it has the uh, eyeliner on that end in black, and then on this end, it's the creamy soft eyeshadow, and it's like a white color, which I've been wanting to use that for a base. And then I bought one of these, the uh, Mega Slicks lip gloss, which this is normally ninety or one ninety nine, but since buy one get one, fifty percent they took a dollar off. So that's what I bought. Got the five. I bought those four items with the five dollars off. It came for nine ninety eight, and then with taxes it was eleven thirty seven. And so, um, oh yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> and also, if you spent ten dollars on um, Maybelline products, you're going to get a three dollars extra rewards back. And so, I think that's what, yeah, extra bucks or whatever it's called. You, I got that back and um, I spent that on these two Wet n Wild, prop, the Mega Slick. So, this is 8578 Sinless and then this is 561A Crystal Clear. And then the other Mega Slick was 564 Cherish. So, the last two Wet n Wild, um, only it was only two cents or negative two cents was the total but subtotal but of course they had to add tax so I paid 26 cents for those last two so all together I um spent 
Wait, eleven thirty-seven plus twenty-six cents. That's eleven sixty-three. So, I for these six items, I paid eleven dollars and sixty-three cents. And that along these two right here would have been sixteen dollars. So that was a good deal. So, like I said, sorry for the late notice. If you all didn't already know about it, but you still have time to go in there today. And then I went to the Dollar Tree. I've been going to the Dollar Tree because um, I sent someone some makeup and it one of the, or three of the palettes broke. And so I told her I was going to go look and see if I could find them again so that I could send them to her. But, uh, so that's why I went in the Dollar Tree. And when I was in there, I bought... I've been wanting some, uh, I decided I wanted to get a dry erase board. I might take it back because I really don't have anywhere to stick this since my refrigerator is covered. But I want to kind of keep a schedule with me. I'm about to be back full time in school and um, doing a practicum and working full time. I'm about to have a schedule really good. So there, this one is full magnetic and then this one just has two magnets on it. but. That's what this one looks like with the seven days. I might keep this one, might take this one back. And then this is just a full month calendar. And so they're made out of cardboard. I, and then the, it just has magnets on the back. And then I bought some dry erasers or dry erase markers. Nothing fancy so for the dry erase boards. Of course, I always go to the book uh, section. And I've really been going to the book section because um, I've been trying to find this book for someone that I can't believe they only had that one in there and so excuse this hair thing you don't want to see what my hair looks like underneath but um I hope I really don't have this but it's the art of social work and the Dollar Tree won't let you return books I guess maybe they feel like you read it but if I unless I'm just that test reader which I know people do read in a day so hopefully I don't already have that but if I do maybe I'll give it away to somebody and then I bought this, uh, the Sally Hansen Maximum Growth Nail Color. So I thought that was cute, just like a gold metallic -y color it looks like. And they had some new uh, Maybelline lipsticks in there. And I guess these are closeouts from different stores because some of them said Ames and like Kmart. Uh, yeah, this one right here said Kmart and at Kmart it was $3. And then another place, I don't think I got one that had another sticker on it. I think it was more than $3, so. Sorry. Hopefully these aren't dried out. But it's the Hydraton lipstick. And I forgot that I bought this many. I should have already had this open for you all. I may just show you all another video of these, depending on if they're... Hopefully they're not okay. It doesn't look dry. That's what that looks like. Okay. One time I bought some CoverGirl uh, lipsticks and they seem kind of dried out. This one is in Dreamy 78. So I'm probably just gonna show you all another video with those. So that wasn't bad, but I bought a lot of them and that's why I'm just going to show you a separate video so I can open them up and show you the actual color. Um, like I said, I've been going through the Dollar Tree just trying to find the dang old thing. And I found two of them so I'm going to mail those to her. That's what that is. I bought some tape for when I'm mailing stuff since the post office wants to charge people for tape. And I've had some of these before, and then someone's haul, they had this, uh, the NYC color wheel, the mosaic eye powder, and they had it in purple, and I had never seen it, and one of the Dollar Trees I went in, they had it, so, you can't really tell, but that's purple, so I was excited about that, because purple is my favorite color, and when I saw that they had it, I was shocked, because I thought I had them all, well, all of the ones that they had in the Dollar Tree. And I picked up some of these because I've used that can before, not this rapid melt, but um, it's supposed to be pretty good. 
and it's the uh, Cold Remedy Plus, and it's 25 quick dissolve tablets, and it says cool mint flavor, so hopefully that won't taste too bad. And this is supposed to reduce the duration and severity of a cold. I've been feeling sick lately, and it's getting around that time, so I wouldn't care about that. The other one for the girl. And then, um, about another book, My Father Married Your Mother, and it says dispatches from the blended family, so it's just says essays from like different blended families. I thought that would just be interesting to read. And normally I don't really shop the food that I bought, but these chips from the Dollar Tree Home Style Select, if they have these in your store, if they have this brand in your store, you should try it because that was good for a dollar. It had good amount of salt on it and everything. Um they have this Ultra Moist Lipwear Lipstick by NYC and it's in 401B Caramel. So it's kind of just like a caramely bronzy color. So I picked that up and then they had these two new items which I've never even seen these online. And it's the Studio. I think the Studio normally costs $3. And they only have these two colors, but it's the uh, lip liner and blending brush. And uh, I got it in wine, which is 82205. And that's the color of it. And then this one in peak grapefruit, and it's uh, 82203. So that's that color. And so it has um, a blending brush on one end. And it's pretty soft, which uh, the Studio Line brushes are pretty, you know, typically pretty soft. And then it's a retractable uh, pencil. I'm trying to get it so where you can see the color. So let's see how smooth it is. That goes on pretty good. So I wonder if they're going to be getting some more of these in there. Because I'll probably get them. And about this, the April Bath and Shower Antibacterial Lathering Cleanser. It says Fight Bacteria Pure Flot. Pure Flot. Purifying Clean. So, one of the girls that I subscribed to, she tried this. So, I decided to try it because every once in a while I'll get a little pample here and there, especially during like that time of the month. To get, you know. So, that'll help. I bought some disinfectant spray. And then another girl, or another lady that I subscribed to, she, um, she always talks about this Dermaseal lotion. And it's. Dermacil Labs says so controls even severe. Put out more than I want, so that hole is bigger than I thought. Dry skin, so it says skin lipid and EFA treatment, hypoallergenic. So it's not really runny or anything. But she says that this lotion is really good. I've been looking at this lotion for a while, and I've never bought it, so I'm just thinking like. Is from the Dollar Tree. Well, not because it's from the Dollar Tree. Because I like stuff from the Dollar Tree. But I'm just thinking it's going to be real runny. This is not. It feels good. It's not too greasy. And it says it has di dimethicone 1%, which is a skin protectant. So it's um, a humectant. So it binds the water into the skin's outermost layers. It says occlusive to block moisture loss from the skin surface. Skin lipids to enhance the skin's natural ability to retain moisture. EFA is an important um, component of the skin's moisture barrier. And she said she thought EFA meant um, essential fatty acids. So this has, I probably should have looked at this before I bought it. <laughs> Petroleum, petroleum is the second ingredient. Mineral oil is the third ingredient. It has some good stuff, but I really try to stay away from trolitum and mineral oil. But that's that. So it does feel good. We'll see how it works. If it works good, I'm you know I'll continue using it even though it has that petrolatum in it. 
I might take that to work because that'll really be good for my hands for after like I go to the washroom. And today I went to Big Lots because I was on my way to go to a different Dollar Tree since the Dollar Trees that I normally go to, they didn't have those eyeshadow palettes. And I've passed Big Lots and of course me being me, I had to stop in and I had to go to the makeup section. So I bought this, which is the Joan Rivers Beauty, the right to bare legs. I have a varicose veins and spider veins. So I bought this. And the funny thing is, the other day, I was trying to... Hmm, this has tape on it. I wish I would have noticed that. I, someone must have already bought this. I knew this looked like it was open. Sorry, that's one thing I don't like about big, big lots. Let me see if somebody didn't use this. Because it will be going back. Can't get it open because I got that lotion on my hands. I was looking at this like this looked like. Kind of. Like it had some empty space in it. I can't get it open. But anyway. Funny thing is. I was watching. Looking for like a workout video on the TV the other day. And I saw a, you. I saw an infomercial for this. I don't know how much they were charging on TV, but it it was only five dollars. And so I got it in the medium, uh, cut cut the medium color. They have it in fair, medium, and tan. And tan was way too dark. Fair was way too light. So I'm gonna look and see if somebody can use this. <laughs> but um. If this does not work, I will be taking it. Well, I'm going to take this one back anyway because somebody in this is taped up. But I'm going to let you all know if that looks like no one's used it, I'll try it. But um, if it works, I'll let you all know. If it doesn't work, I'm taking it back. I wonder if that's what happened with that. Which, if somebody brought that back, they don't need to be selling it. So. But they had some different uh, e.l.f. products in there. And... I was looking online at this. I wanted this when they were, they had like a fifty percent off, or they had a um, they were having like their treasure hunt. I just don't like paying for shipping and handling, so I'm glad I didn't purchase it because I was able to get it for the, it's the same price, but I don't have to pay shipping and handling. And it's the three piece zip zapper. And online people said this else zip zapper works really good well. So it has the one tone correcting concealer, which I probably won't use that because it's probably not gonna be my skin tone. The zip zapper and then one concealer brush. So, and then they had this in there, which I love these 32 piece um, eyeshadow palettes by them. I don't, the last two I bought, I really don't care for them because they have a lot of matte colors in it, which I did not know that when I purchased it. So, this is the warm eyeshadow uh, palette and it has a lot of gold and it looks like the natural uh, colors. And they had another one in it in there, but um, it was the one that I already own, so I didn't purchase that. But this was only five dollars. Yeah, it looks like half and half with this, with half being matte and then half having like that shimmer, or I guess shimmer is what you would call it. And then it has the dual applicator brush and then a mirror. So I can get with that, but now it's looking like more than half or matte, but they have some good colors in here, so I was excited about that. And they had a lot of uh, Rimmel London uh, mascaras in there for $3, but I didn't want to pay $3 for the mascara. <laughs> Um, and then they have these CoverGirl Lash Blast Luke's or Luke, how do you say it? Lux uh, Ma Mega Volume Shimmering Mascara. And so I got this in Black Platinum and it's $8.40 and this was only $1.50. It was like a little storage bin that had a lot of different little random stuff in there. And I saw these so I went ahead and picked them up. And then I have the same one but this one is in Black Royale and $8.50. So I'm going to give my mother one of these and then 
keep the other two for myself and I got two of the black royales and those are only a dollar and fifty cents so because um the the cover girl that comes in the green uh tube I forgot what it's which one it is she liked that but she didn't want me to buy it for because it was eight dollars so um so since so I saw that I just picked it up for and then I bought two movies which is another thing that I always have to look at the movies I bought milk for three dollars and that I guess this wasn't a good movie this recently came out oh that, that was a long time ago 2008 and it was for three dollars so and then this is called before the devil knows you're dead and this came out in 2007 and it was only three dollars so I like Ethan Hawke so that's why I got it and then I read the back it sounded a little bit interesting I thought I picked up another movie okay no that's this okay so I got these two movies so that's my haul guys um, I hope you guys enjoy watching it leave uh, comments and rate and please subscribe thank you guys bye